Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Austin and today I am very excited to take another look at Monsta X. I'm going to react to, I think, their most recent releases. Um, all of the videos I'm reacting to today came out in 2021. Um, so I'm doing Gambler, One Day, Rush Hour, and You Problem, four music videos. Um, I have only reacted to Monsta X once on my channel and... I don't know. The the only song I think I reacted to Trespass and Love Killa. I remember Love Killa. I like that song. I listen to it sometimes. Um I don't know. I I still don't know anything about Monster X. I don't even know how I don't even know how to describe them. From 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 what I remember, I think I walked away with the impression that they were a little bit older, a little bit more grown and more aggressive is kind of what I walked away. I was like, oh, this this group is kind of aggressive. It's kind of like hard. Um, so I'm interested to see maybe if I'm going to see a different side of them this time. Um, I think it was really important for me to react to some of their newer stuff first. And then if I really like their newer stuff, maybe go back and react to some of the older stuff, which I don't know, might be more iconic. A lot of times people's favorites are like older songs, but I wanted to see what they're doing more recently. So I'm excited to check it out. If you're new to my channel, consider subscribing, check out all of my other videos. And if you want to watch my other Monster X reaction, it was a long time ago. I think it was like more than a year ago. So it's been a while, um, but I decided I wanted to check them out again. So let's go. All right, first up is Gambler. Um, I'm very excited about this title. Uh, <laughs> I love gambling which that's, that's, not, that's not a good thing. <laughs> that's actually not a good thing. Don't be like me. Um, because you win some, you lose some. And I'm curious to, this video could be dark. It could also just, it could also be like exo lotto. I hit the lotto like more, bro I don't know. Let, let, let's see what direction we take. Okay, the birds, it's gonna be creepy. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he owes somebody some money. He's <laughs> tied up. Oh no. Wait, is that like the hotel employee? It looks like he's got a name tag on. Oh no. <laughs> if you don't know, now you know. Hey. Ooh, his voice is really interesting. I don't know if this is like his normal singing voice or if he's just doing it to fit the style of the song, but his placement is really interesting. It's like right up in the middle. Of, it's like forward, but nasal, but also very throaty. That's a really interesting sound. You don't know, now you know. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Oh god. Okay, so I think they're singing with that type of placement, um, with that type of vocal technique because it's it kind of fits the style of the song because now two members have sang with a very similar placement. So I'm assuming we're gonna hear it switch up a little bit. Also, that jacket, gorgeous. Okay. All right. Oh yeah. I like that. Ugh. 40 seconds in and already being disrespectful. Don't you really want to feel alive? Hey. So good. Who's that? Who's this man in the middle, like walking towards me, looking very pretty, very handsome? Oh. Open my pack, let me show how I 
Wait, what? My suit is black. My suit is fresh. It's black. My suit is fresh. Open my pack. Let me show how I bang. I don't know what that means. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. <laughs> oh, I like that guitar. I love this part. I love this beat. Okay. Hey. Listen, you're surrounded. They're surrounded by the police and they're just like, oh, let me dance. Um, I actually really like this. I don't know. I don't quite know. Like, I haven't heard many things in cape. Like, I haven't heard really anything that's similar to this. It's giving me, like, aggressive, but also dance, bop. Which, I think I like it. Because it's also kind of dark. But it's dancey. It, it's, like, it's interesting. But they can also sing, like, I hope... I, listen, I don't know the songs I picked today. I just picked the four, like, from this year, rant, like, because I wanted to see their newer stuff. I hope that, like, one or two of them is more of a slower or, like, a vocal-focused song because it sounds like they got some good singers, too. Obviously, they do. They obviously have a lot of talent. It's a K-pop group. Um, but I think I like their style, which is interesting because I usually don't like more aggressive that's a lie. It depends on what kind of aggressive, but uh Oh, that was really good. The distortion in his voice when he was... Ah! I don't know how to take you yet. The SWAT team. Interesting. I don't. <laughs> Is that it? Okay. I don't know how I feel about that. I think I like it. I really liked the the part at the end where he was like going off on the vocals and adding adding that distortion. It was dark. It was aggressive. It was kind of some of the things that I remembered. But this song had like that dance beat to it. No idea what happened in the music video. I was very there was a lot there was leather leather. Um, <laughs> there was a there was a lot going on in the music video. I think that. I thought it was a bomb, but then just all of the power in the city went out, and then I guess they were police officers, and I I don't know. I don't know what happened, but I think I liked that song. I think I did. 
Let me know your thoughts. So let's move on to the next one. All right, next up is One Day, and this is super interesting. I was just looking at the release dates of all of these, and like one was September, one was November, the next one was December. They released a lot of music videos very close together, so that's pretty that's pretty rare that that happens, um, but I love that. So let's go. Ooh. Okay, this one sounds pretty. Oh. What is this in English? Aww. Already, this is my favorite Monster X song. Already, I love this. Th oh, this is a short song. Two minutes and 30. Dang it. Dang it. Anyway, I really, they sound really good. I love the beat. It's very clean. The song sounds very sweet. Their vocals. Hey. I like his voice a lot. Ooh, wait, that's the same guy that was being like, Aggressive? Like that's the rapper from Yeah, Hey. Uh oh. All right. Yeah, wow. Ah, his voice. This might be my favorite voice so far. It's like warm and I don't know, I like his voice. You had on my chest a summer in the hills. I wish you the best with somebody new. But they'll never love you like I do. They say hindsight's 2020. Hey. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll. Wait, that's see through mesh, sir. That, that's the outfit. He's given like business, but. Sexy. He's really pretty. too short that's too short and <sighs> okay well I absolutely loved that song oh no sorry it started auto playing um I absolutely loved that song that song was super gorgeous the vocals <sighs> I said I hoped that there was like a really pretty song in this uh marathon and that was it. That song was gorgeous. They were gorgeous. Like, I don't know. That was a sad song about like missing someone and like, maybe I'll see you again someday. But also they had their arms out and they were wearing leather and he had his thing zipped up. And like, there was like, why did they leave in the first place? Like who, who, who would leave that? <laughs> I don't listen. I don't know. But that song was gorgeous. I loved it.
All right, next up is Rush Hour, and I don't know if this is connected to Gambler, but it looks like, yeah, it looks like it's a police car. Oh, is that a red mullet? Who is that? Okay, it's for me, it's, it's this man over here on the left with this like black and it's this man right here on the left he he's gorgeous sorry i don't know any of their names oh is this gonna be a western Eat this. <laughs> i needed a warning for that also eat what What is happening? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I just... Oh. I don't I don't know what I'm feeling. I got whiplash because I would <laughs> eat this. I was not expecting I, I thought it was gonna be like a western. Like I was getting ready for like um I don't, I don't know, like a hoedown. <laughs> Oh. Yes. Oh, this is an aggressive anthem. Oh, that was really cute. That dance move with the kick. This, um, oh no, I don't remember his name. Is this the guy that just released the Voyager, I think? I think that's the name of the song. One of the members just released like an album. And I remember hearing a teaser for that song. I think his name's like Ki Hyun. I think that might be his name. Um, I heard a teaser of that song on Twitter and... That song sounded like a bop. So I might go back and react to that 
like soon. Um, I feel like it might be this guy. Let me know. Hey. This beat. See, this feels iconic. This song feels like an anthem. This song feels iconic. I actually really liked that. It's really, like, for me, I don't know how to say, I don't know how to say what I want to say um, without being offensive. Not to, not to Monster X, but... I'm hit or miss when it comes to aggressive. A lot of times, not just in K-pop, but like music in general and, and even movies and stuff, when something is aggressive, like overly aggressive, sometimes it comes off as cringy. Like they don't always pull it off. Sometimes it's just like, that was weird. That that was weird. <laughs> uh, and Monster X is aggressive in some aspects like i've noticed like their rapping is very aggressive like yo eat this <laughs> like some of the stuff they say is a little bit weird but it's not coming across as cringy it's coming across as aggressive and maybe a little bit quirky a little bit weird um but then the song slaps and the beat drops and it's amazing um, I do think that my favorite Monster X moments are some of the more like vocal moments. Um, sorry, they they kind of break down, and the one day is definitely still my favorite. But I did actually like Rush Hour probably a little bit more than Gambler. Um, I probably liked Rush Hour about the same as I liked Love Killer, which is pretty positive. Yeah, so interesting uh that's three i have one more left for today called you problem so uh let's check it out all right last up for today is you problem i feel like it's gonna be like it's a you problem it's not a me problem i'm good i feel like that's how this is gonna go but let's see oh he's cute Hey. Wait a minute. This is the group. Um, this is the group that released a full English album, right? Like they released an entire album all in English, I think. And I feel like some people didn't like it. I just remember they released a full English album. And when it came out, it was kind of divisive, I think. But if this is about to be like a retro bop, I'm here for it. Let's go. Aww. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Wait, hold on. How did we get there? How do we get to naked on the floor? Hey. Listen, I don't know anything about their personalities. I don't know anything about their personalities, but it's weird for me to see him being, like, cute. Because he looks super cute here. And I think this is the very aggressive rapper one that had, like, the, the hair, the interesting hair. I think that's him. And he, he looks really cute here. He's still, he's like a DJ here being cute at the bowling alley. It's a you problem. You know 
it's out my hands. You gotta leave to solve them. Cause you've been making plans. Oh, and singing. It's simple. Get lost in the romance. And just dance. Oh god, oh god, did you see his face? Get lost in the romance and just dance. This guy right here with the like cream colored jacket, he's cheesing and I love it. He's goofy. Hey. You need to shake yourself down Cause I know that you've been missing me uh, Oh god, look at his face You need to shake yourself down Cause I know that you've been missing me Look at that acting, look at He's just like I don't know, that's kind of being seductive Jim <laughs> His shirt says Jim I don't, I don't Is that his name? Does that say Jim? Okay why is he being see based on this music video i'm gonna make a couple guesses here sorry people might be annoyed but i have a couple theories I feel like this guy in the red right here, I'm going to call him Jim. <laughs> I'm sure that's not his name. Um, and if it is, that's a that's a fine name. Um, I feel like he's the seductive one with the red. And every time you say, please, I'm a boy, 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 boy. This guy right here. And every time you say, please, I'm a boy, boy. Vocalist, like main vocalist here probably. Boy, 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 on your knees, on your knees. This guy in the cream is, uh, I think he's the goofy one. He seems kind of silly. Yes. Oh. That's got to be the main visual. I actually really like this. Ugh. Wait, hold on. I just noticed there's five members. We had six before. So I'm assuming one of the members is in the military. I think this group is older, so they're probably starting to serve in the military. Um, I do know Wanho was in this group, so I believe they started with seven, and then there's six, and there's five in this music video. Oh man, I didn't count the members in the other music videos. I'm sorry. Hey. I feel like they might be missing the other rapper. Wait, wait, he's drumming. Do they play instruments? Let me find out they're a band. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, that was so good. What's this? The dreaming disco. Oh. 
working at the bowling alley. Okay, that was cute. I really liked that. Um, I really liked seeing that, like, goofy, like, quirky side. Um, because I was getting the, like, very aggressive <laughs> vibes uh, from some of this. And it's just kind of refreshing to see that other side of it. Um, so that's it. That's my first... It, it kind of feels like a first look, honestly, at Monster X, because... I did Trespass and Love Killa, and I didn't really... I still don't have a good feel for the group. I still don't know who they are, like, as artists. Because we had Gambler and Rush Hour, which were more aggressive, harder-edged, but also vocals and really hard rap. It feels to me like that's kind of Monsta X's, like, usual vibe. But then we had One Day, which I think is still my favorite Monster X song. That song is gorgeous. I loved that song. That was beautiful. And then You Problem was super fun and like disco and retro. I think I'm probably going to like the English album if, if it's kind of fun and kind of has this vibe. I'll probably like the English album because I think it's not that I don't like their more aggressive stuff. I just really liked the You Problem disco fun, and I really loved the really pretty vocals of One Day. You know, there's some groups where I like the beat, where I like the title tracks, but I prefer the B sides because of like the incredible vocals and stuff. Like, there's a lot of groups like that actually, and then there's some groups where I love the B side or I love the title tracks, and like the B sides are just kind of meh. So. I don't know. I haven't heard enough of their music yet to determine that. But if you just made it through this entire video, thank you. Let me know what Monster X song or music video you think I would like based on like my preferences and stuff. Obviously, I might get to a point where I just check out all of their stuff. Maybe. I'm not committing to anything yet. But I really liked One Day. And I really liked You Problem. And Rush Hour felt like an anthem, and Gambler was a lot, a lot. So um, I feel like this is an iconic group. I definitely owe it to myself as a K-pop fan to check out more of their music. Um, plus, they're so stinking handsome. Like, every member of this group, very attractive. The vocals... The vocal's great. I loved, like, all the little distortion and stuff. Uh, let me know what members I pointed out. I probably pointed them all out. Um, but, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this reaction, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.